I'm standing in the middle of Berkeley Springs, West Virginia, a small town on the eastern panhandle of West Virginia, the same county where I actually grew up. Behind me, you can see the Berkeley Springs Castle. The Berkeley Springs Castle is on the National Register of Historic Places. It's roughly 140 years old and has a storied history that includes fabulous people and events and terrible tragedies alike. Locals actually say that the castle is cursed because of so many of its owners have had such terrible fates. Today the castle is owned by Vidare. Vidare is a far-right anti-immigrant website and uh, that has published white supremacists, the Unite the Right founder, and various other far-right figures over the years. The owner of Vidare, Peter Brimlow, and his wife Lydia would tell you that they're not racist, neither is their website. But one thing is true about Vidare and its presence here in Berkeley Springs at the castle. It's torn the town apart. People are torn into three different camps, one that wants them to go away and despises them, one that quietly or not so quietly supports them, and one who would rather just not talk about it at all. Nobody can quite agree what to do about Vidare and the Brimlows, but everyone in Berkeley Springs agrees that they've changed things here forever.